Hey everyone, welcome back to another video and today we're doing a hair tutorial and I'm literally so excited for this because I've been wanting to do a hair tutorial for so long on my channel, but I don't know I just never I don't know I just never did it and I'm really excited for this one in, in particular because I really like this hair color and I'm really obsessed. I just want to make a disclaimer. I'm not a professional. I didn't go to school for hair. I didn't work in a salon. I don't work in a salon. I don't I don't I like I know what I know about hair extensions from like my own experience wearing hair extensions for like eight years now and I'm obsessed with them and you can change your hair however you want how many times you want with clip in hair extensions and I'm gonna show you guys how I basically go from a bob and my natural hair to like my hair like this like this length this color I'm gonna watch me catfish you guys and just keep on watching. <laughs> this is gonna be true life. I'm addicted to hair extensions. No, but seriously, I am freaking obsessed with them. I love hair extensions. I've been wearing them since I, since I was 15. Um, and I don't think I'm ever gonna stop wearing them, to be honest with you. So recently, I cut my hair into like a bob and it's like really blunt and like it's a really blunt cut but I just got really bored and and I was just over it um and I was like I need to like change my look so last year spring um no summer of 2019 I bought these luxury for princess hair extensions and I bought them in the latte color and I'll insert a picture of how they look um without me like dyeing them but they were like a really light like almost blonde color um it had like highlights in it so it was it was a really really pretty color but it was just I, it didn't last that long um so recently i was just looking at the extensions and i'm like i barely wore them i wore them again in april for like a week and then i hated it and i took it out i took out the hair extensions and i changed my color back to like a dark brown um and then i was but like i was just like i need to do something with these like they're too good like the quality is really good and i want to switch it up a little bit so that color that it originally was i changed it into like this dark um like golden like kind of hint of like blonde in it, it kind of, you can still see the highlights in this hair um so it's it's so cute it's so pretty and it's like i it's a look that i've been wanting to do for a really long time to my own hair but i just never had like the patience to just sit there and like tone my hair and get the highlights and do all the like extra stuff that it that goes into like a balayage or whatever it is you want to call it um so i just basically i'm doing it with hair extensions so i'm going to start with actually the front of my hair what i do with the front is after i part my hair which is not it's not even straight i mean sometimes i really don't care if it's straight or not this is fine and then i like at a like i come in with the comb at like an angle like that so I'm like really close to like the part and I'm also really close to like the front of my hairline right okay so I just clip it here and I get like really close to my hairline I want to show you guys so I get like really close to my hairline here because I like how like the long bang looks on me versus like my short hair um so then that's that sometimes like my hair will peek through but look how cute and it blends like right away and my hair like the ends of my hair are like a ch chocolate brown color and then like the roots are like a little bit darker and I didn't do that on purpose um back when I dyed my hair to match like this original shade I um I dyed my hair like a chocolate brown so it's been like fading to like the tips of my hair so I felt like this was like the perfect time to um to dye these hair extensions and you know do my own little balayage with hair extensions so i'm just doing the same thing on this side brush it out so i brush it out and that's how they look in the front you see and it pretty much like blends like right away and then after i'm done with the front i'm gonna turn around and i'm gonna show you guys the back so regardless of the set that I'm using, I always start with a three clip weft like this one and I always put it at the nape of my neck and I feel like it looks the best when it's done like this. So 
some people clip in their hair differently i've seen people do like the really long ones at the bottom and then do the smaller ones at the top but i feel like for me it blends better this way so now i'm gonna let my hair down after i clip down and brush it out and then i'm gonna go right above like that hair extension right right above that hair extension actually a little bit less hair and i never really part it with a rat tail comb because i've been doing it for so long so you guys i'm not a professional i don't do this for a living this is not my actual job i just do this to my own hair extensions and hair so you can see like i messed up the hair dye a little bit here you guys can see it's like really light here this is like the original color but don't judge me okay so after the three clip so after that three clip i part that space and then i put this one it's another three clip left and it's still really close to the bottom of my head great cute I'm gonna take my hair down again and then I brush it out part is really long it's all the way across my head and the reason be the reason of that is because this hair extension is a long one it's a four clip width some of them you might get a five clip but this is a four clip like you guys can see and then I clip this one in right where I made that part so I clip that Clip it, clip this side, wait, clip this side in, and then clip this side. Well, it's more like on the crown of my head, huh? you guys can see. It's right here. And then this one is a three clip. So for this one. So I wanted to tell you guys before I continued um, putting in the clips in my hair is that the biggest thing when it comes to blending your like short hair with long hair extensions is having a lot of clips. So uh, having a lot of extensions. Luxury for Princess hair extensions came with 10 and I have 13 in my head. So these two that I have here and then the last one that I clipped in on the back of my head those three are from a different set so i have 13 clips in my head so i feel like sometimes you might have to like either buy a track either buy a bundle somewhere and like make an extra set of like clip-ins or um or use like an old uh, like an old pair of clip-ins and just like mix it into like whatever set you're using on your head because it just doesn't look good if you have a little bit of hair extensions and then your hair is mad short like it just doesn't look good um so i feel like that's a really big tip that i wanted to tell you guys that i've learned over the like the last like eight years of me wearing hair extensions so for this section of my hair it's like you know it's still short it's still gonna be noticeable so i take this two clip with and i place it right here by the by like my ear area so it's like that so from the extensions that i from the set that i got um I got um, these small ones and these are like freaking lifesavers so I cut two of them to the length of like this size of my to the length of this um, extension right and then the other ones I left so I can put them up here and then they're the length of like the like my entire head um, I feel like that was complicated but i just basically cut these so that they belong at the bottom and then i cut the other two to so that i can put them at the top of my head so they're the same length of like the rest of the hair i have to unclip an, an extension to like fit this one the small one putting it in here just be careful not to like pull any of your hair your hair and then <clears throat> this just adds more like extension down here those little pieces down there those are like what give it away you don't want to get clocked this is a two clip width as well and i'm doing the same thing that i did on that side i'm doing it on this side and i'm just clipping it right here take the small one the little baby extension and i'm gonna find a little spot down here 
gonna go over here. So now these babies right here, I'm gonna see if I could show you guys. So right over here, I feel like I don't have any extensions like in this area. So all of this, all of this hair is my hair. And I feel like sometimes like the wind might blow and then I end up looking like, like a little, like this is just not cute. <laughs> so, so I'm gonna take this part of my head and I don't, I don't want to get too close to like up here. I don't want to get too close to like like the top layers of my hair because I want to hide this extension. Obviously, I don't want it to be noticeable. Um, so I'm going to grab like a, this amount of hair. And then I'm going to place this extension right there. So if it's just like that. And then I'm going to brush it out. So although it's not a big extension, I feel like it still adds like some type of like, I don't know. It might not do anything, but I feel like it looks better when I add that there. I feel like it's not as much of an empty space. And if you have like extensions that you bought from other places and you have older ones that are still in good condition, girl, cut them up into little pieces and freaking put a clip on it. Put that shit in your head. To be honest, I did the same thing to this side. That's what it looks like. And then I drop it. Sometimes I feel like I have to like go back and like reclip because some of them get like a little loose. And I like brush my hair over them. Pretty much like blending all well together. So you could leave it straight, you could put it curly. I feel like I'm just gonna add a little curl to it. Just like curl it like I would normally curl, like my normal hair or anything. I'm pretty sure you guys have seen so many people like wand their hair. So I just like curl it. hair extensions i've literally been wearing them for like almost 10 years real soon um and i'm just obsessed really hope that you guys enjoyed this video if you guys want to see more hair videos tutorials different hairstyles that you've seen me wear like on either on my instagram or on my channel some somewhere um i'll be more happy more than happy to do that for you um but yeah thank you guys so much for watching see you guys in the next one.